First of all, I guess, uh, welcome to the club. Yeah, thank you. Um, what do you know about Hereford FC? Uh, well, I've, I've played against them quite a few times, especially, you know, I was a cop play for Contra in the Championship. I think, uh, I think Hereford League One, League Two, I think. I think it was League Two. Not to say at the League Cup uh, at that stage. I remember the crowd was was roaring, rocking, to be fair. And we, I think Stuart Fleetwood scored, not to say at the Cup. Uh, so that was an interesting evening obviously for me. I definitely got a rollicking in the training room after that game. Uh, but just just really good memories of the place. Really big club, um, you know, especially for where we are now. But uh, you know, as a club, you know, obviously they've had you know troubles the last few years. And but the, you know, on the way back up, three promotions in four years is you know a fantastic achievement. Obviously, it's going to get a little bit harder, you know, when you go you know through the leagues. But um, you know, really looking forward to the challenge and you know a big big football club in this in this league anyway. You've come across Russell Slade before twice as a player. Yeah, I was you know lucky enough to play um, for, for Brighton uh, when when uh, the gaff was the manager. You know, I had a really good spell there. We were struggling at the time when he came in, and uh, he turned it round and, and we survived. Sort of last last game of the season in League One. Then I moved to uh, Latin Orient uh, the following season when the, when the gaff was there. He took me there as well. And I think when I joined, or we were nineteenth in the league, and we finished seventh in that in that in that season. Fifth round against Arsenal in the FA Cup, so again, really good times there. And obviously, when I had the opportunity to link back up with him at, at Hereford, you know, I couldn't really refuse it. Really, you ended your playing career, of which you made over 300 football league appearances. You ended it at Oxford United, didn't you? Yeah, I, I just under 400. And unfortunately, obviously, I unfortunately had to retire at 31 years old. Um, you know, a, a decent career. You know, from Championship League One, League Two. Um, Unfortunately, obviously, had bad injury, so I, you know, I had to retire at 31. But you know, I, I, there was good people around, good manager at the time who wanted me in and around the place. Um, so I went coaching straight away. You know, in the 18s, so sort of 23s at Oxford. Uh, since then, I've had a spell in the National League North at Kidderminster. You know, first team coach, under 23s coach there as well. So I've got experience in this league. And I, I think not last season, season before, just missed out in the playoffs. Um, yeah, so experience in this league, you know, went back to Conjure City, my first football club, you know, where it all st sort of started. Um, you know, but obviously, uh, when I seen this opportunity come up, I, you know, I couldn't really turn it down, really. So I'm really happy to be here. How would you describe your coaching style? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, you know, it's, it's four or five years in the making, so you know, you're, you're still learning all the time, and, and, and especially with you know, like you know, managers like Russell Slade, where. You know, he's, he's been at some top football clubs, you know, he's one to learn off. So, you know, you take little bits from different managers. I've had Michael Appleton, you know, Chris Wilder's doing really well. I've played under in. So you try and take little bits from, from each other. But I, I enjoy being out on the grass, uh, coaching, especially, you know, in the week. You know, that's where, you know, you sort of nitty gritty sort of stuff gets gets done. So I enjoy I enjoy that. And obviously you see the, re, you know, the rewards on a Saturday, you know, with the, the work you put in in the week, really. You were involved in the training game on Saturday and obviously we trained on Tuesday as well. So you've had a couple of sessions now with, with the lads. Yeah, I've had, uh, yeah, I'd come last week, last Thursday, I had a, had a session then. Um, obviously, at the in-house game on Saturday, uh, another training session this week as well. And, and to be fair, the lads have been fantastic. Uh, the tempo, uh, the intensity has been, you know, it's really hard enough for me really how, um, you know, how much they've, you know, worked their socks off really. You know, we're all really good lads, all really eager to learn, eager to, you know, do well for this football club, and hopefully, uh, you know, we'll take that sort of training intensity into games, and um, you know, picking some points up and moving up the table.